I love all these lists. 10 fragrances that'll make her wild. Seven sexy fragrances to make her go crazy. Two and a half fragrances to make her wag. But they're always leaving the dudes out. Dudes are always left out of the mix. And at the end of the day, the most compliments your funky ass is gonna get is from other dudes. So let's roll my motherfucking music so I'm gonna put you on to five absolute sexy fragrances dudes love. Sexy Blessed morning, my beautiful peoples. You know who it is. This is your boy. C to the U to the B to the A. Am I speaking lies? At the end of the day, you're going to get more compliments from other dudes than you are from shorties. That's just how the game is. Rarely do you get compliments from other women because you're either in a committed relationship, wife, you got an Apple air tag up your asshole and is like tracking everything you're doing. You can't go to the bodega without your chick straight up binocularing. You're not getting compliments like that. Let's keep it a thousand. I've gotten like 75 compliments in my 40 years of life, so shut up. So what are the fragrances that dudes are going crazy for? Like these are the hypest of the hype fragrances that I seem to find that dudes outside of the fragcom world absolutely go ape shit for. So maybe these will work for you if you're not into the fragrance space like that and are just looking for compliments. A real easy option, Creed Aventus. You're gonna get compliments with this whether you want to or not. Other dudes are gonna be like, yo, my dude, you wearing that shit too? Yo, I got like 17 bottles, I love this shit. It be getting me mad bush, and it really doesn't. But it's okay, because if in your mind you feel that way, then that's what it is. I mean, in my mind, I'm 6'4", 230 pounds, completely ripped with an A-pack and a deep V. So if that's what I feel, that's what it is. And Aventus will absolutely get you compliments from other dudes and drives other dudes insane. Next one. In that same space to drive men insane, Roja's Elysium has kind of that same Creed Aventus effect on other dudes. You wanna be the baddest of the baddest. You're gonna go roll in with your boys at the spot, like, yeah, yo, aha, ha, ha, yo, what up? Saying hi to nobody. Yo, we in here, B, let me get seven bottles and four sparklers, all right? Why? But it's an absolute mass appealing masterpiece that other dudes are gonna compliment you on and particularly ask you, yo, where'd you cop that, B? You smelling good, let me get, yeah, yo. I need that. How much? Oh, okay. It ain't nothing. It ain't nothing. Two checks later, they go buy this shit, and then they're in the club along with you. Y'all smelling like twins trying to bag the same shorty and her fat friend. It's all Gucci, B, but it's gonna be your mans that's gonna compliment you on this next one. And you know we not forgetting that Dior Savage, kid. 75 sprays later, you killing it in the scene. Completely disregarding the fact that women are already up on this joint. They're so exhausted of this scent profile. I mean, there's even TikTok videos, and I hope I can find one, of shorties completely like, if you wear this, you're like the ultimate fuck boy. That's what, they're exhausted of this shit. It reminds them of the two dudes that they slept with this week. They don't wanna know nothing about it. Their ex-boyfriend's cousin's little nephew wore this shit to their high school graduation. They're done with it. But dudes go crazy for this shit. Yo, you got that savage kid, ha <laughs> ha Dudes go crazy for it. Next one. And I'm not gonna sit here and just single out the younger generation because if you're in an old school vibes and you're in my age demographic and if you pull up in a party, you're gonna get another OG hitting you up with like, yo, who's smelling like Fahrenheit right now? Yeah, you're gonna get that vibe. It's gonna be only the OGs that are gonna give you love like, coño manin, yeah. Mierda, que bueno tu we Que rico loco, bien. You're gonna have dudes like sweating you while that dude's wife is gonna be there like, it's official, he's crossed over. I knew this marriage wouldn't last. OGs oh, be going ape shit for the Fahrenheit. It just gives you that nostalgic vibe. It's still a great fragrance, but it's gonna be dudes that are gonna give you the compliments. Next one. Excuse me for one moment. Ah! Blue the channel. And it won't be the Parfum version. It'll be the EDT 100%. Yo, guy, let me get the blue the channel joint. Yeah. That's a great fragrance, super popular. That's why it sells the amount that it sells. But I rarely feel that this is because a shorty complimented you on it. It's because you smelled it on your mans, a coworker, a homie. Maybe you mustered up the courage to elbow the dude at the bar next to you while you ordering your whiskey and be like, yo, Papa, what you wearing, bro? You smell good, dogs. Why you looking at me like that? It ain't weird, is it? Yeah, it is. But it's all right though, you know what I'm saying? Bromance is bromance. When your brother's in arms, you know what I'm saying? You wanna smell fantastical, blue the channel is the one that you want. 
So only dudes is gonna compliment you on the next one. And we mustn't forget the coworker compliment. You got your boys at work that you chill with. You're not working remotely. You're in the office setting, but you've watched all the YouTube videos that content creators like myself been telling you, oh, this is the ultimate work safe, sexy fragrance that you have to wear. It's gentlemanly, it's perfect for the office, and that's Aqua de Gio Profumo. So while you sitting in your office trying to impress Stacy, your, your hair looks nice today. Ronald is the one giving you props. Come on, man. Neil, shut up. Don't talk to her. Shut up. Thanks. Good looking out. I appreciate it. How about you, Susie? You smell anything different? No. Okay. This is the real world. Am I lying? These are five fragrances that dudes go crazy for to impress other dudes. They think they're doing it for shorties, but it's really for other dudes. Cause let's face it, the chances of you getting a compliment from a shorty before a dude is the chances of you making her come before you make another dude come if your life depended on it. Think about it. If you had a gun to your head and one 50 cal bullet was ready to pierce your skull and the guy told you, you have one opportunity, you need to pick Susie to come or Ronald to come. Which one is guaranteed to? Ugh. I love y'all motherfuckers from the heart and I'll see y'all bitches next time. You know who it is, biggest in the game. I know y'all thinking right now like, what would I do? <laughs> you just, huh? Fresh, who's best? One of them's gonna pass the test. Who buy? For the fly gun holder, money folder, roller, roller, star tag. When it's time to call back. For the rough brother that raw way, this nigga Jay, it's a game, but he don't play. Hey, for all the chicks that got dead in the penthouse suite on top of my mom's crib. Hey. It's long since you never get in. It's long since you would think that you would. <laughs>